More heartbreaking news tonight. Investigators say a two-year-old girl in Peabody is dead after she was exposed to illegal drugs while living in her mother's car. WBZ's Julie McDonald speaks to family members who are now grieving the loss of this little girl. New tonight at 11. Family members and friends along the North Shore devastated by the loss of their sweet Lily, who would have turned three this May. I planted that the year Lily was born. How precious my granddaughter is to me. When this Lily next blooms in a New Hampshire grandmother's yard, it'll be a bittersweet reminder of a two-year-old angel in heaven. When I got to that emergency room and I saw my daughter and not my granddaughter, and then I was told what had happened. I just fell. I was in disbelief. Investigators say the toddler's mother, Vanessa Jason, called a friend early last Wednesday because the two-year-old was unresponsive. Police later found evidence of illegal drugs in the car Vanessa and Lily were living in. Unfortunately, at 18, when she got involved with drugs, it changed her world. Um, and it's been painful for me to watch ever since. Last August, Lynn police charged Vanessa J. Singh and Derek Iorio with reckless child endangerment after the family was found sleeping in an unregistered car. DCF responded and let the child go home with the father's family. How many charges um, are you going to put against a mother before you decide to take that child away? Lynn police said other relatives have long criminal histories. This grandmother heartbroken over what the family has lost forever. DCF needed to take that child away and send my daughter to treatment. Not guilty pleas were entered for two felony charges permitting substantial injuries to a child and reckless endangerment of a child. Vanessa Jason will be back in court next week. Outside Peabody District Court, I'm Julie McDonald, WBZ News.